know okay. something about you? Oh yeah, absolutely right. Yeah, thank you for giving me this opportunity. I can say something in front of you. I, uh, my name is Miraz. I am from Bihar, but right now I'm connecting from UAE. We talk about my hobby. So I have a lot of hobby huh? as well as I have one channel on YouTube, English Connection with Miraz. I like play cricket, parliamentary, as well as football. It's all about me. Music is the very important part in your life. Without yes, music, yes. it's very difficult to you survive. Whenever you no, get no. time, you try. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. Well, actually, I'm a homemaker, so I do my household chores. That's why most of the time, like, no, I just play the music and I do my household chores. <laughs> because it gives you know, me energy. <laughs> Yeah, oh, favorite. Oh, yes, sometimes, oh, uh, yes, it gives me energy and sometimes like, you know, that, you no, know, my mood is off and I don't know why I'm going through this kind of problem. So, but when I listen to this kind of songs, so like, whatever is happened, it's happened for a reason, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I got it. I got it. <laughs> Okay, so yes. whenever you feel blue that time you watched any, any you listen to any song, but you yes. feel how everything is perfect to that time you don't feel very so. So may I know about you, as you mentioned, because last time I watched your video with, uh, what is the name of that person? That person who belongs to um, Indian, but right now he lives UAE. That, uh, he is a tutor. His name is Gopal, I think so. <laughs> Anand Gopal, sir. Anand Gopal. That video was an amazing video, actually. He is a tutor. He explained all things very well. So, ma'am, I know about you more, more about you because, as you mentioned, you are a YouTuber. I know that you are a YouTuber because I have already visited your channel. You are a So, may I know how long have you been learning this language and what is the reason of behind this learning of this language? Okay, see uh, that it's really nice question that as you know, you already visited my channel. So why I'm took this session actually uh, and when I started my journey. So two years ago, I started my journey. Even so many people also asked me this same question, same question. And I reply them that I started my journey <clears throat> two years ago. And if I talk about what's the main purpose to learn this language, since like, no, we are a homemaker. So whenever we are homemaker, we do something that people are their first question that comes to their mind that as a being a homemaker, why this is the your first uh, priority to learn this language? Why? Because homemaker means that you have to do your household chores, except these things, you can't do anything. Most of the people, they think like that. But no, as I mentioned several times, that I'm a, like, no, I'm a homemaker, yes, but as well as I'm a mother of one kid. So as a mother, if I, I most of the, nowadays, most of the parents, they send their child to English medium school. So as a mother, if I know this language, so I don't no need to hire any uh, private, any tutor for my son. If I know this language, so I can uh, guide my son and I can teach my son. So that's why I'm learning this language. And this is my main purpose. <laughs> wow. What was the great. Yeah, you want to become a, you want to good environment at your home. You want to, to be a good environment at your home. That's why you are learning. Super. So, uh, okay. So I have, I have a second question to you because as you mentioned, it's just two months, uh, two years, two months now, I think so. You have been learning this language. Okay. Yeah. okay, sorry. You have been learning this uh, uh, la beautiful language for two years. So what is the difference that time and now? What is the changing you are feeling on yourself? Can I say something yeah. about yes, it? Okay. Yes, yeah. it's like, it's a really nice question that uh, like you no know, some people also they uh, they drop comment on my video that ma'am uh, you know that uh, uh, when you started your journey two years ago, so what kind of method you followed in your initial days? And no, what I'm do you feel talking that about? This is, I got I'm it your point. Your I got method. it your point that, like, no, yeah. when I started my journey two years ago, 
and compared to now like no why have i improved or not what is my reaction like no so i got it your point that yes yes uh, definitely i can say that i when i started my journey two years uh, ago i never uh, ever thought that i would be able to speak but uh, nowadays i can say that i am able to speak this language without uh, fumbling <laughs> and also i make mistake <laughs> i agree with it and but, that one speaking because uh, i think that I? yes okay. yes sorry yeah and if yeah, i talk I'm about changes like that, that I... if i talk, if i uh, talk uh, if i talk about changes that yeah definitely i improved and learned and so many things because uh, my grammar portion was uh, good but if i talk about my speaking part i used to make a lots of mistakes because i had some concord issue but after that as i uh, started taking one one session so and after that i realized now how to make a sentence according to the mm. concord so yeah nowadays i can say that yeah i am now i am little bit now i'm improve i'm improving a little bit day by day and learning is not like that and learning is never ending process that today i just uh, yesterday i started my journey and within a one day or two day i will be fluent in this language no not like that So, do you do you do any mistake by when you speak in Bengali language? Actually, you right now you're connecting from the Bangla, uh, Kolkata. So, do you feel any nervous? Yeah. Do you feel any problem when you speak in Bengali? Do you do any mistake? Yeah. Otherwise, you don't do any mistake when you speak in Bengali. <laughs> no, no. See that it's like no normal when that way i'm i'm at home so i speak randomly my i speak native language randomly but when it comes to speaking with uh, educated uh, people so when that time i thought that i my even my need my native, not, even in my, my native language, is, language, native language. i'm talking about when you speak at bank sorry My, my question is simple when you speak your when you speak in your native language just your bengali any language that time you feel nervous yeah that time you do any mistake yes, sometimes it depend yeah sometimes because the situation is not out of control so at that time yeah realize because i am fumbling i am unable to uh, elaborate my sentence in my native language own native language at that time also i realize yeah sometimes also i make mistake when i speak my native or native language sometime na every day, every time you don't do any mistake sometime by the way your tongue sleep yeah, yeah, yeah. otherwise because you don't have to understand bengali is my native language yeah so i think this is not our native and this is not our language first of all you should conquer in your mind english is not our language english is the our Uh, but uh, having said that, we are learning, we are doing something. So mistake is the part of the any language. Mistake is the part of the speaking. I have seen lot of video, lot of thing, a lot of good speaker. They also do mistake while speaking. So I think you don't fear about the mistake. Mistake is the part of the speaking. You are speaking well. You are doing great job. And sometimes you do mistake in your native language. So How yes. could you expect you speak in English that time you couldn't do even <laughs> a single mistake? No yes. possible. Oh yes, yeah, yeah. Because it's not our native language, and we didn't get in our surrounded people. They also speak their own native language, so we didn't get an environment. So it's very quite. It's very tough for us to learn this language, and we started our journey at this age. and we completed our study from bengali medium or samis medium hindi medium so it's not possible we do question all but lot of people deny lot of people say like that i don't have any partner i don't have a, they always do they always miss guy they always do something excuses and procrastinate yeah actually i don't have anything so may i know about your opinion according to this language what which kind of method we should use for learning this language 
yeah love it. Love it. if anyone really passionate to learn this language they should speak as much as possible they should speak because speaking comes from speaking if i say that no i will not do it i don't have environment i don't have anything but still in nowadays we are live in this era where we all people are engrossed ourselves in social media and social everything has pros and cons and we use uh, social media so if we use it as a uh, pros and we can do so many things and nowadays there are cost so if we follow them to so definitely we can learn this language and we can't say that nowadays we don't have anything where we are using social media so we can learn it very easily and books anything everything we are uh, everything is in our hand these days so those people who like mm. you no know, make excuses no i don't have environment i don't have partner how can i learn this language so they, that means they are not they don't want to learn this language they are just trying so they are just know very well how to make excuses because and nowadays on the if you yeah, search anything on the youtube if you search if you search anything on uh, social uh, on youtube that uh, so you will get the answer even on google also so uh, sometimes you know that uh, when i face some kind of problems that what's the correct answer of this sentence and should i use this uh, which uh, uh, preposition should i um, use in this sentence so when i search it i immediately i get the result so this is a very good platform i can say this. so why we are waiting for why will mm. i always try to make excuses it's not good and you know that like no uh, yeah this time is the, we should have, yesterday past is past and we should always welcome our tomorrow okay uh, yeah absolutely our past can never define our future we just like to all the also... we try <laughs> yes regarding future our is... past so we can't change anything but we can change our future yeah everything is depend on the present what will you do in your future and what will happen in the future but your past can never define your present yeah your future yes. so again if you do something in present definitely you will get good result in your future okay this was the nice conversation with you because i am very glad to see you here first time i connect with you is my pleasure to connect with you because i couldn't know about your name rampi just suddenly i saw your message on a beam i okay. drop you message and and for um, finally i connected with you it's my pleasure so rimpi uh, if you don't mind if you want to may i ask some question but time for the time being i have a lot of question on my bucket list for the time being <laughs> i think we are supposed to hang up the call it was my pleasure thank you for give me your sufficient time spend with me i learned lot of thing for you it's my pleasure okay okay